What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Country Boy. And I'm the Bishop. And we are back with another live podcast Ooh. of Brother to Brother. Man. Man, I told y'all, man, from the last episode, I know y'all enjoyed that one right there when we Ooh. talked about being what, brother? Role models. Man. Role models. Role models. Great mentors. mentors. All right? And we really enjoyed that that conversation. We got a little deep. We actually talked oh, about yeah. the guys, talked about the girls. And we de definitely um, encourage y'all to continue that conversation going. But... Before we get into this new and new subject that we're going to talk about, right. we're going to thank all our sponsors gotta, out there. We got to handle that business. Go ahead. Handle, handle that business first. Handle the business, oh, brother. Well, I, <laughs> I ain't that old. I remember the business. All right, we want to thank our sponsors, Mrs. Marcus Beasley. And this is why we go over time. <laughs> KYW, man, I'm telling you, his hair products, bro. He got KYW for women. He okay. got Silky Sensation for for kids. Then he oh, got wow. that boss legend for boss me. Boss legend. Bro, I'm telling Man. you. So not one, not two, two but, three. but three products on his line. So definitely make sure y'all oh. check out that um, that product. That brother is doing some great things out there. Yes, also, we want to thank another of our, one of our sponsors out there. Not Shot Maze. Oh, bro, man. you don't understand. She came and did our office. She COVID cleaned our office. COVID cleaning, y'all. COVID clean. So definitely hit her up. You see Woo. it scrolling at the bottom. Also, make sure y'all check us out. Our own, very own good friend and sister. Yes, yes, yes. Apostle Dr. Nia G. Every Wednesday at 8 o'clock. Man, she come out with this candy conversation where she sit down and oh, she man. lay the ropes down. And, oh, and she's man. real. And it's, it's deep. She is real. So definitely make sure y'all check her out too. Everything is scrolling at the bottom, so make sure you check them out. And we cannot forget the guy who had us, you know, he was, he so fresh, fresh and so clean. He had me out of my, out very out first out show. Out my comfort zone. Come on now, man, you know. <laughs> He ain't got no swag. Hey, baby. deeper than rhymes, baby. That's hey. my brother, though. Deeper than rhymes, we got thank much love for you, brother, for um, doing the things that you're doing for us. So definitely make sure you stay in, pay attention to what's scrolling at the bottom, and that way you'll be able to catch all, all those sponsors and also support those sponsors yes, as well. Yes, please so, support. And if you want to be a sponsor, just hit us up. Let us know. We're gonna hit you all out um, on all our social media. Um, Outlets out there. Come on, man. You like you talking about me? I know, yeah. man. It's like blah, 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 blah. <laughs> but we there. But we there though. But you know what though? If they gonna hit us up for sponsorship, it's two people they need to call. Okay. First, they need to call Belinda Gale Management. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I'm telling you. Okay. Which is scrolling at the bottom, and then the person that we always gotta. Pay extra money because you always go over. <laughs> Dreaming Studios, Dreaming baby, where we Studios. filming this, baby. I'm Absolutely. telling you. Absolutely. Dreaming Studios, she got everything you need. If you can dream it, she can come up with it. The girl got an eye for fashion. She got an eye for decorating. Man. Nice. So make sure y'all support. Make sure you check them out. So now that we got all the bills paid, appreciate all the love that's given to us. And now we got the bills paid. Let's get into what we want to talk about today. Let's get into some real things out there. So let's, real so, the, so what we're going to talk about today is going to definitely hit and going to step on some toes just like it did last week. But we're going to check it out. What you got, brother? We're going to step on your toes. I, I got one question for you. Not too much. Because I know the answer for me. What, what you got? If you had a daughter. Mm hmm granddaughter. Okay. Well, you have nieces and cousins, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dima. Yeah. Would you let them date the younger you? Absolutely. Man, stop lying. Absolutely. Man, I know, see, we I'm never had no argument. I'm somewhat of a now catch. Now we finna have an I'm argument. I'm somewhat of a catch. Now you are. I, I said the younger you. I've been a catch. Man, please. I've been a catch my whole life. A throwback I catch. That's what it is. That you, you back. Release. <laughs> That's what it was. <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> Look, but man. No, honestly, though, a, seriously. For my whole life, I've always been I always been a gentleman. I've always been a gentleman too because I know I have a mother. And I know what I don't like, I wouldn't like for a man to treat my mom. I wouldn't want to do that to anybody. So okay. and I grew up seeing the wrong way to treat I, I, a woman. So okay. I'm telling you, I've been a catch all my life. Well, I'm a, I'm a, well, I'm gonna be real. I don't know what he's doing. I've been I'm a catch all my life because I'm, I'm a good catch. Right I'm a keeper. Right I'm okay. a keeper, keeper. But my younger me, hey, what's the, what's the real answer? The real answer is yes or no. No, I'm yes, not gonna lie. Like See, I'm telling you, the younger me. Yes, yeah, I was. Even on the whole I took care of. Wait a minute, now, hold on, hold on, hold on. I was a gentleman. Okay. I treated the women very good. Okay. Don't get me wrong. Because okay. I, I was so raised you, to you treat just them good. Player, player from the I was a player, player from the Himalayas. Okay, back was in the you. Day. I wasn't a player, player from the Himalayas. Now, well, that's you as had I got older, like I, I became the player, player from the Himalayas. But when I was younger, you know what I'm saying? You had a swag like I had. That's what it was. I know. I had this 
swag. No. I just didn't have money like that to be spending on having man, wedding costs. Man, hold on, wait a minute. Hold on, bro. See, now you're going into another show. When we now you're doing how to, the most. How to date cheap. Yeah, that's going to going to cheap date. This series that we're on, going to hit it from the mentorship all the way down. We're going to hit on everything. Bro. But today we're talking about what you have them date the younger man. you. And why would you have them date the younger you? Okay, see, I have five daughters. Count them. One, two, three, four. Five daughters. And that's why. And, <laughs> and yep, God punished me because for the, my back, my past, that way, way, long, long time ago. <laughs> but I tell them all the time, look here, I'm real with them. I tell them exactly how I was. Okay. I was no good. I was not a boyfriend type guy. Okay. Because I played around. Okay. So I tell them, if you, mm -mm, not me. <laughs> now, after I turned maybe about 25, you know, I matured. I learned a lot. You matured? Settled down. Yeah, I did. Okay. Yeah. Well, some people mature earlier than, oh, than most. <laughs> I was one of those that matured. I had to. Some people had to grow up faster than others. So I, I had to grow up faster than, you know what I'm saying, than the most. You know what I'm saying? Usual guy. Yeah. I mean, I work. I work. I went I to work. school. I went to school. I doggone, but I didn't get out there and play the streets because I had focus on what I wanted. I'm sure you had to had it to where your parents got you what you needed, your first well, car. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm sure it was like that. You know, he's from St. Louis. No, time out. You know what I'm saying? I'm from good old country Alabama. You know what I'm saying? You got to hustle and grind for your guys. You know what I'm saying? time out. My parents, I had to get a job because I feel like... Come on with it. Tell the if, truth. If it was up to my mama, all my stuff would come from the goodwill. And I'm gonna I'm gonna take you way back. Same way for I'm me. I'm gonna take you way back on this one. Wool work. Okay. That's why I used to get my Bargain shoes time. and stuff. Bruh. <laughs> no. So I had to get a job at 16 so I could buy my own clothes. Exactly. That was the same way in my household. Well, my mama wasn't going to the mall ever. She don't, she said, I would not go to the mall. Exactly. You would be going, I, had, I would take you. Now the only thing my father did do for me. Like if I wanted, like when Jordans first came out, they were sixty dollars back then. And he bought them for you. Huh? No, he did. What did he do? Give you he the said, money to go get them. I'm gonna give you. If you come up with half, I'm gonna give you half. Okay. But I'm not gonna give them all to you. But you're gonna earn the half. I'm gonna give you. So I'm all like, if I'm earning the half, I'm getting from you. Then I'm paying for it. He said, you're learning. First, first lesson <laughs> for the day. So. It took you to 25 mature. I'm just anyway, telling you. Anyway, <laughs> I didn't have to, but you know, we, we all, like I say, live and learn. We all live and learn. But I'll tell you, I, I, I was told that I was a player, and I, but I wasn't. But it's just because I had friends. I have a, I had a lot of female friends that would, you know what I'm saying, that would hang around. And they was the ones that would check. Jeff, oh, oh, she, she don't want to act right. Do, do, do. You said you was <laughs> and, told you was a player. Yeah, the girl you know that I be with, but I bet he'll play her because, you know what I'm saying? Just like saying Whitney wasn't on crack. <laughs> on, everybody saying it, that means you was. You was a player. Everybody it saying was, it. It wasn't no everybody. Man, come I'm on, just saying. It was, it was just come on, man. certain be ladies real. that couldn't get be with real. me would say that. Because, like I said, my, my friends would be like, nope, she ain't good enough for you. Nope, she a hoe. She doing this. Excuse my language, but that's what they would say. No, They'd be like, no, nah, she was just with so-and-so. We looking out for you. And I was like, okay. Anyway, but unlike him, Listen to this guy. unlike him, I'm going to be real with you. I'm telling you, I knew it cost money. I knew it don't cost that much money, man. Okay, well you was dealing with some cheap ones. I wasn't dealing with no. You cheap have to have ones. a spit game. You gotta have a spit game. Well, maybe I have no spit game because man. all I knew is, hey, you you gotta go on because I like I like winding it down. I'm gonna take you on a date. We're gonna go to a movie. I ain't have time to go. Oh, we gotta take you on a movie today. This day, boy, I gotta take you on a movie today. This way. oh, I'm just gonna chill with you today. And then that was just that's just too much. That to me, that was too much work. Man, look. It that was too work. much work. I, I love work. my sleep more than work. It was not work, man. It was not work. I mean, sometimes, what you got? What you got? sometimes it, it would be, you know, you don't always have to spend money. You just go to the park, you know, have a little picnic, go on a canoe ride. Stuff like that. With you different, with, with a different, with a different. It doesn't matter how many. It doesn't matter. No, but I mean, no, you man. saying like you had to do all this? No, man. I, I, I'm telling you, I, 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 this, I, this, I, this, I, this, I never this said that was my girl. I went straight from, I went straight from high school to the army. So high school, I had the same girlfriend the whole, whole junior high, high school, right? Down. That's so that's why. That's why. That's why. That's why. Now we get to the roof. What now we get to being on lockdown. It's just that hey, I, 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 that's who I chose to be okay. with. So okay. that okay. you know, I I was more mature. I didn't can't, need can't. to have. 
I didn't need to have no 30 girlfriends King to King. validate me. I didn't need to be validated by anybody. I did it. I you probably to... needed to be validated. I need to be validated. Yeah, you did. I was a validation for them. <laughs> 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 well, I mean, well, I mean we yeah. gotta agree on that because I sure would say the same thing. I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm making you look good just like you're making me look good. And but all of them were girlfriends though, because I didn't have girlfriends. Of course, I didn't have friends. girlfriends. I didn't have friends. But still, was too much work. I didn't do a lot of work though. <laughs> Well, I did a lot of work, but yeah, you did. Yeah, that, that was a lot of work. You gotta, you gotta make sure you got this time set for this one. Well, yeah. You gotta remember who is calling in this one. You gotta remember. They don't don't uh -huh. get mixed. Don't Babe. get mixed up if you Babe. if they come to the house uh -huh. and your mama like, cause that's what my mama do. Hey, and say the wrong name. You what? know what I'm saying? And or hey, <laughs> I mean she still do it to this day. She'll be like. Hey, so and so be like, mama, no, mama been over for shit. years. Mama didn't do that to Why you. Why would you do that? <laughs> well, when my mom, when they would come to my house, my mom was like, hey, sweetie. See, All of them was hey, sweetie. Well, see, never, never uh, know. My mom wanted to know their name and she wanted to make sure wow. that she like, you hurt my baby, I'm hurting you. <laughs> you hurt my baby, don't come back around here, don't, I don't want to even see you. You had my deal. That's how my mama was. I'm just telling you, <laughs> my mom was very overprotective of me. Just, you know, so it's just like, she was like, you hurt my baby, I'm hurting you. <laughs> but yeah. she she would get to know them. My mom is mm -hmm. just that friendly person. She just wants to get to know them. She would sit down and talk to them every day. So. Well, my mom was just the opposite. She was all like, I know I ain't going to see her next week, so ain't no sense of me getting to know her like that. Well, we know what they were. <laughs> but back, but <laughs> back to, back to, back, back. We're not but even going to do but that. See, but see, I'm being, I'm, but like I said before, the younger me uh -huh. is a totally different person from the, me now, the more responsible me now. Okay. The one that, okay, looking at my daughter's like, okay, this is what you need to look for in a man. Okay. This is what you need to be wanting out of a man. Okay. That's the older me. Okay. But the younger me, nah, if, he, if, he, if they brought me home, <laughs> well, first of all, if they brought me home and I got to talk to him and all that came out, no. Okay. Because when I went to the house, I was very respectful. How you doing, sir? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah, yes, man. So I was like a chameleon. So, so, so the parents really respect. didn't know. They didn't know who you who were. I really was. Yeah. They knew their respectable yeah. one that my parents taught me to be. And we all was like that, you know. So that's you, you all want to be respectful when you meet the parents and stuff like mm -hmm. that. It's just I we knew how we act when we was outside of the house, and you right. know, so once you get with around the parents, of course you're gonna be respectful. But mm -hmm. I was still respectful even outside. You know what I'm saying? Right. To where you know. Like, like literally, I was so respectful with her, you know what I'm saying, my first girlfriend, well, my first girlfriend, my high school love was, we, we, you know what I'm saying, I could stay at their house, no problem, um, it was, I drove her mama car, her mama like, here, you come and, you come and drive, she was the only, she, Look, she would trust me to drive over them. See, I think that's the difference, see, you from Montgomery, you was limited to where you could go, so you could only have one girl, <laughs> because everybody knew everybody and where you from. <laughs> You know, everybody know everybody, so you really was, good, you know, I, I, okay, I get that's, it now, I get you, I get that. Yeah. yeah, 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 we wasn't in no big city, big city, yeah, y'all. See, I had places to hide, yeah, see, different, we, different places I can go, see, we weren't trying to do that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so it just lets you know, it's, it's, and it's most people out there that's, that's like that too, that, well, yeah. that, that have, you know what I'm saying, that same experience of, well, no, I wouldn't, but it's like, now that will come to hunt you, you know what I'm saying, as you get it older, did. to where now you got daughters like, oh, and knowing that it's, it's probably guys out there that's probably 10 times worse than you. Five daughters. <laughs> that, that, that's, how, that, that's what God did to me. He said, okay, I seen how you did, did people, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you all girls. All girls. Damn. All girls. You're never getting the bathroom. So, fellas, y'all paying attention to this right now? Y'all might want to get all your girls. Get your act together before you start. Because I'm telling you, right? If it's that bathroom you, come down, don't be coming home every to get my gun. And blah, blah, blah. You know why you saying that? Because you knew how you was. Yeah, because somebody's parents would get you the gun. <laughs> That's what it is. Because I just snuck out. Of, I just snuck out a couple windows. Well, so I didn't have to worry about nobody. <laughs> nobody parents saying, you know, saying, give me a gun because I was just that respectful to them. To where it's like well, it just was a to the parents. it was just a respectful thing. Like you have your you have your time, you know, prom night, you have you know what I'm saying? When you go on days if if they, they trust you enough to go out and do the right things, mm -hmm. it's like we're gonna trust each other to go out to do the right thing because that's you know what I'm saying, I respect your parents. But a lot of people don't think I just tell you, I just thought like that. Because mm -hmm. I had sisters. You know no, what I I'm got, saying? I had sisters, I had a mom, <laughs> and I know you got sisters. You know what? But that's I used to be like I used to be like, man, wow. I'm the little, I'm the baby one. But man, I'll beat you up. 
And you know what's funny? And it was just like, man, you, you know, they were like, is that your little, uh, you know what I'm saying? This is the crazy part. I got five daughters, right? Mm -hmm. And I got five older sisters. <laughs> Lord have mercy. So, but, but the thing is, so so my thing is, you know, just to, just to think about that when you when you were um, when you were younger and guys mm -hmm. like that when you you know so now that you're thinking back back to it back then you know what I'm saying I know I said validation earlier but mm -hmm. I know for a fact a lot of people did it for validation for their friends to be in the cool the cool club you know what I'm saying and the, you know what yeah. I'm saying the cool man's club cool boys club or whatever you want to call it you know mm -hmm. that's the only way that will make you popular oh you 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 been with this girl but now now you with this girl but then now you with this girl and now you you know what I'm saying it's just like oh yeah he's yeah. the man right yeah and then you know what I'm saying but when they flipped over you know what I'm saying on the girl side it gets Totally misconstrued with the exactly. double standard. Exactly, girl can't do that. Right, we, we, we exactly. call it all kind of stuff out there. You names go, they, get, they, like they got names, but the guys didn't. Now you know what I'm saying. Now that we're in the age that we're at now, yeah, they're giving the guys that names. You know what right. I'm saying? Well, exactly. I think back then, what it was dogs. We was dogs. All men's are dogs. Yeah, dogs. You know what I'm saying? But you know what I'm saying. So that that's just how you know what I'm saying it was. But I'm like, now that you're older, what 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 was your mentality of thinking? You know what I'm saying back then? If you don't mind being, you know what I'm saying, just. Straightforward with the people, what? Right. Cause I'm telling you, I, I, it wasn't in my mind. It wasn't in my mindset to do. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, it was like, I ain't got money like that. You know what I'm saying? I know it already costs. We go out to eat. I'm buying everything. You right. know what I'm saying? So I'm just. Now, like, I, I thought that's what I had to do for every. If I was to be oh. with any female, I thought I would have to wind it out. That's just always been my mentality okay. to yeah. make sure I'm taking care of them. And, and I had I had the same like thing, that. but it's not always that you have to spend a whole bunch of money though. See that's that's the thing about it. I, I, I don't care I, if it was a bunch of money, any money. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it ain't a bunch of money. It was any money. It's like it's I not, want to make sure I'm treating you. You know what I'm saying? But you know what I did one day? I took uh, my next to youngest daughter. Mm -hmm. We was, we was living in Florida at the time. Okay. I said today I'm gonna take you out and show you how to have a date, and you don't have to spend a lot of money. How a man can treat you good, and you don't have to spend a lot of money. Okay. So I got I got the blanket out. Mm -hmm. We put some little food in the in the basket and stuff. I took it to the beach. We sat on the beach. We played some games on the little, on the little uh, um, the mm -hmm. cover that we had down, mm -hmm. and we just enjoyed the scenery of the beach. And we sat and talked. And I told her, you know, about my younger days and mm -hmm. my, you know, how I was. All right. And I and said, that and that's what you do. Yeah, we did all that too. We went out. You know what I'm saying? We went out on, you know, so what well, we had to spend money, but still, right. you know what I'm saying, like. You gas to get there, you know, yeah, you know, yeah. certain things, you know, the holidays, Valentine's Day, you know what I'm saying, the, all the holidays, I, you know, so that's what I think. Trust me, you, you, cut, you, cut, all all, you, you cut all them off during, during, those, <laughs> during those, giving, those giving seasons. See, this, here, <laughs> so here's, see, so here's what I'm going to say. Y both, we give y'all both sides we of the spectrum. We give y'all both sides, you know what I'm saying, give me from the big city and also give me from the south. But I'm going to tell you this right here, the women in the south didn't play that. <laughs> I would tell you the women were the ones that I know you'll get beat up. They weren't beating up the girls that you were with. They was beating you up. <laughs> so if you didn't want to get cut, if you didn't want to get cut or have your car vandalized, I suggest you act right. Because they will well. mess you up. So definitely make you know what I'm saying it definitely was a different Yeah. It definitely was different from a big city, from a city mm -hmm. life than the than the country life, because they like they, they got time. But see now, and, and, that, and that's why I said in the beginning, I don't, I don't sugar, I never sugarcoated anything mm -hmm. about my life with my daughters, right. so they know what to look for now. If they see a guy that I described, I who I right. was back then, right. 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 so they know. Oh, my daddy said something about that dude right there. Mm -hmm. Let me. Mm -mm, he sounded like my daddy back in the day, <laughs> and you know, but I, then, I even, hope that it helped. Them. Well, yeah, but even then, it's uh, but even then, it's uh, it's a trial and error, just like it was for you. You know what I'm yeah. saying? It was a trial and error for those women. You know what I'm saying? Those young girls. You know, for them to decide. You know what I'm saying? Who would be the perfect mm -hmm. person for them? And like I said, you had to grow, and you grew to realize. The thing is, you grew. You grew up. You know what I'm saying? Faster than most, cause some guys are still out there doing the same thing they were doing. You don't see exactly. <laughs> So you you gotta understand that, and I mean to tell you guys, souls don't unfollow us just because we we calling you out. But we already told it's, you <laughs> It's just it's just keeping it real because that's just life. You know what I'm saying? But it's exactly, you start off young, but the thing is growth. You know what I'm saying? Growing and realizing what you know. What Learn I'm saying? from what your you mistakes. Say. There you go. Learn hey, from your mistakes. This is how I was. This is how I am now. I see what I did, but you know, so thank God that I made it to change my ways and right. be a better person to be able to teach once again back to the mentor to teach and teach coach somebody, somebody younger to so what now we can get them to mature a lot faster than 
I did, or did you know what I'm saying, or did you? Exactly. So that's well, all that is. But a, a lot of times we 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 have these stories, and they funny. Yeah, they funny, yeah. and people be all like, "Are they are they for real with what they're saying?" <laughs> yes, I'm for real with what yeah. I'm saying. I'm yeah. describing me. That's, that's what that's how I make sure we do is, is, is keep it honest. Like I said, it's unscripted. We ain't reading nothing. This is totally us. This is our story, our opinions on how we feel things should, you know what I'm saying, should be and how it's going. We don't say for us in our life. And I'm right. sure there's a lot of people out there who can relate, you know, oh. out there that can relate. And if you feel like you got something to say, make sure you, you hit us up. Like, let us hit know. us up. Yeah, let us know. We have a Q&A right after this show in our YouTube. So definitely make sure you come on over mm -hmm. to that. Mm -hmm. And we'll definitely be there to answer any questions. I know or even, called. you know, I'll, I'll go I'm back and forth it. with you any day. I love an argument. I'm going to get it. No, you're going to be, you gonna be the good guy on this one. I'm going to be the bad guy on no, this one. Because I see both sides. I'm, I'm, I've always had that mentality to see both sides of the spectrum. You know what I'm saying? To understand my side, understand your side. At least give you... Your, you know what I'm saying? Let your opinion be heard. You know what I'm saying? If that. Let your opinion be heard, and then we, we'll go from there. Let my opinion be heard, and we'll go from there. Agree to disagree. Yeah, and that's basically yeah, how it goes. I'm bad guy in this episode. Oh, man. Here we go. So, they're going to kill me. But with all that being said, everybody, I do appreciate every last one of y'all for coming on. Man, why you always got to... You said I'm the oldest, but right? You said last now, time I'm, I'm I went over time, so that's why we started keep, early. Did, 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 we didn't go ahead and What's up, man? It went out because I'm like, you, are we going to finish or what? Because you said last time we went over, we went over time. But anyway, we got the COVID on. With that being said, Come thank y'all for coming in and on the show. Uh -huh. Like I said, make sure you follow us on all the social media outlets. That's Facebook. That's Twitter. That's Instagram. Make sure you follow. They free. They free app. So make yeah. sure you get on there and follow us. Follow us, and he gonna answer your back because I don't know nothing about none of that stuff. <laughs> it's scrolling at the bottom of the screen. Make sure you check us out. It's, probably, it's right there. Scrolling back and forth. They probably went across three or four hundred times. So you have plenty of time to. <laughs> Actually, check it out, write it down, or go straight over it and follow us. Also, on our YouTube channel, there. come right on over to our YouTube channel. Like, comment, and subscribe. Hit yes. that notification bell and let us know, hey, we doing good, we doing bad. We we we, we open to good suggestions and bad suggestions. We ain't going to beat you up. Hey. But you say something out of line, I know how to find you. No, I'm just kidding. See, but go ahead, bro. I thought you said you forgot about that old you. <laughs> now, I ain't say nothing about that. We was talking about doggone how we treat oh, him. I ain't God. say nothing about a temper or, or finding you. <laughs> but, but go ahead. No, uh-uh. Mm -mm. And you say I'm the, I'm the old one. We get it off the muscle. <laughs> go ahead, brother. Go ahead. Go I, know, ahead. I know I'm the look. Crackheadish looking right now, and I ain't built up like you know. Go ahead and shout out our um, sponsors, bro. Yeah, oh, I always gotta give me a hard time, but this is my brother, Marcus Beasley. Marcus Beasley, I know you watching, brother. Hey, man, look here. Now <laughs> you done gave my wife, my kids, all your products. I ain't got the man product yet. <laughs> I need that false legend in my life, bro. Can coming. you hurry up and get me some? It's Please. Coming. It's coming. But Silky Sensation, KYW, I'm telling you, your hair is going to be laid with these products. Yes. I'm telling you. And understand, this is a barber that's created all these uh, products. My here. barber so, at, the, at that. My listen, barber. listen. It's my a barber. That created these products. He had to all going to put it barber. out there that it is barber. Hey, because hey, man is. Yeah, he do a good job. He do, he's smooth with the thing. He's smooth. But, but so that just lets you know right there, he know what he's doing when it comes to those type yes. products that's dealing with your hair. So definitely check him out. Check his sites out as well. Follow him. He's down there in the, that scroll. All this information is there. Also, who else? Not shy names. Not shy Woo! names. We'll put you back out there. Hey, I'm Don't be shy. I never even Get heard. Clean. I never even heard of COVID cleaning until I met. Oh, Lord have mercy. And she came in our office. She said, look, because we was going to stay in the office that day. Mm -hmm. And she was like, uh, -uh y'all got to leave. <laughs> we was like, what? She said, it's like I'm fumigating. She cleaned, Whoa. Like, she cleaned like my mama. Because I was Bruh. like, man, would you let the window up? What? Man. What you doing? But so, Ain't so no there is up here. No COVID so, around so, here. Hey, you need your place clean. Definitely check her out. Also, Dr. Apostle. Apo Apostle. My man, don't forget that. Apostle. She'll, Apostle well, she'll doctor. Come, but she'll come through, boy. She'll hit you with the book. But, right. <laughs> but Dr. Apostle yeah. Neil G. G. Candid Conversations. Candid Conversations. Make sure y'all check Woo. her out. All the information is following down there. She definitely hit you with a good word. Man, she I may be an apostle. Oh, she may be an apostle, but I'm telling you. Hey, she ain't far from doggone. Look. Hey, she'll put the switch. 
I'm I, telling you, but I, she I, but she keeps it real though. Like one of my buddies used to say. Like one of my buddies used to say, I might be saved, but I know <laughs> I'm not too far away from the road. <laughs> one foot in and one foot one out. One foot in, one foot out. But hey, but she keeps she keeps it real, like, real. And and then the thing absolutely. about I like about her, she used her personal testimony because she ain't absolutely. always been saved. Absolutely. And she still absolutely. make mistakes and she absolutely. still flaw. And she don't come out as being that person that's holier than thou. She actually lets you know. You know, is keep it straight and keep it real with you. So, keep it real. That's, and that's what we need. That's what we need. Keep it real. You know, they say they need that one hundred. Now, I need you to keep it real. You know I need that one hundred one. Oh, ain't no such no thing. One. Ain't no such thing. Keep it real with me. Now, <laughs> our final sponsor. Okay. I'm, I'm a plead to him. You know, he be he be he be getting me out of my element. Okay. Cause they gonna see us in some colors and stuff later on. Deep in the rhyme, hey dog. Can you give me a blazer, a button down, <laughs> you know, anything, you know, dealing with like my style too. Cause we're gonna represent you. I need a little, little yeah, yeah, yeah. Give, give him the give him the grown gentleman look, you know what I'm saying? I'm sure he but got that something. Sweatsuit was off the chain. That that day. Day. Hey, I'm telling you, comfortable, it was great, oh, material. Definitely check him out as well. You guys can get you some great products out there. So those are all our, those are all of our sponsors out there. If any of you guys would love to be a sponsor, like I said, hit up. Our one and only Belinda Gale Management that's scrolling really? down at the bottom. Also, uh, uh, the first we have, you know what I'm saying, that we got to thank for letting us have this amazing building we in right now. We thank her every time you go over your time and we got to pay her dough. <laughs> dreaming Studios, baby. Dreaming Studios. I'm dreaming that we ain't going to go over time and I ain't got to pay her no extra money. That's, that's, that's what I'm dreaming. Dreaming. But you just keep on going. <laughs> but that's I what we do. A bunny, baby. Hey, that's what we do. So don't forget, follow us on all social media outlets and we will holler at y'all on the next ones. Thank you. We out. Peace. Deuces, baby. Deuces. Man, I tell you, the dog going to argue look, with this guy all the time. Bro, look. You ain't have a lot to do. I ain't lying to the baby, but it's the truth. Bro, come on. Matt, come on, man. When have you known me to be a player, player See, from the See, that's how I know you're lying right now because you call me Matt. See, when have you known me to be the player, player from the Himalaya? Nothing you. Well, no, not when I met you. You're right. But you lying. <laughs> I'm tired of this. Let's go. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of you. <laughs> what time we at?